But even with Nat Turner, you know, you, you can say, well, they prayed their way out of slavery. They did not. They didn't pray their way out of slavery. They had to look within themselves to have the bravery to strike out running. That's all it was to it. And some of them good Christian slaves that was running out got caught, killed. You telling me Jesus, God didn't give a fuck about their prayers at that moment. Like that makes sense. Everybody was Christian folk. Black folks should have been able to just strike out running and have angels just fluttering over them the whole time. No dogs can catch them. No white men on horses. No, no, you know, getting caught, being punished, being killed. None of that. Good Christian folk. They prayed before they left. But don't nobody want to think about that, though. Don't nobody want to add that to the perspective. We want to talk about, oh, the ones that got to safety, oh, that was God. But all the ones that died and were killed and, you know, the hundreds of years of being treated like pure shit, oh, well, that's just a part of the plan. Jesus wasn't worried about what y'all was praying about then. And I'm wrong for at least thinking about the shit a little differently. Doesn't make any sense. You can pray all day. But until you get up and strike out running, nothing. The people that stayed on those plantations, who thought that Jesus was coming, maybe tomorrow. Ain't no point in me risking my life. Jesus will be here, I'm sure, next week. I'm sure of it. Some people spent their whole lives waiting on Jesus. Some people struck out running. Some people prayed before they struck out running. Not many of them prayed because that's all we knew. That's all the religion we had. Many of them died. 